Okay, this is just going to be a super quick tutorial here about how to flash uh, one of the custom firmwares that you see here. The Atmosphere Orion X, if that's how that's even pronounced, and the SX OS, which they have as Team ex uh, Executor Operating System here. Doesn't matter, these all come from the website, which is right here. And all the downloads and stuff are at the very bottom of the page. So you can scroll all the way down there. And it's any of those three that you see there. But that's not why we're here. This is assuming that you download that. So how the heck do you get the things on there? All right, so it's pretty easy. Follow the logic here. Cool, uh-huh. So you plug that in there, all right. That's fine, cool. And you plug that in to your computer as you would in a USB. And as you double tap the button that's on the actual dongle, right? Where's it at? There we go, that's what I was looking for. There's a folder. Or a whole drive actually, it shows up R4S. And uh, basically, this .uf2 folder or file, God, I keep misspeaking. It can be replaced by any of the RF UF2s uh, that are in these. So, if I'm going to put Atmosphere on there, I'm just going to open it up. Boy, how do you just drag that and cover up the old one? And that's it. Now it'll work like a charm. Or if I say, yeah, you know what? Actually, I think I just want to do um, SXOS. I could put that on there. And again, it'll just overwrite the one that's already there. And it'll automatically close, which is fine. Then you just plug it into your system as you would any dongle in the USB-C port. And hold the volume up and power button and it'll boot right into it. It's just that simple. Thanks for watching guys.